One of the easiest ways to bring a vehicle with you when traveling in a Class A motor coach is to flat tow it. And today I wanted to put together a list of the 10 most popular vehicles that I see millionaires towing behind these multi-million dollar luxury motor coaches. Now, one of the ways that you're able to tell if a vehicle has been set up to flat tow is a lot of times they'll have tow hooks like we see on the front of this Ford Raptor here. And the Ford Raptor is definitely on the list of the 10 most popular tow vehicles that I've seen. Those of you that have been following the channel for a long time know I used to wash and detail these RVs and was in different RV resorts daily. So I had a lot of opportunities to see what type of vehicles were being flat towed. I cleaned a lot of those vehicles. Now before flat towing a car behind a motorhome, you definitely want to check the owner's manual from the manufacturer to make sure that that vehicle is able to be flat towed. Some vehicles have different models that are flat towable for certain years, but not other years. Also, some vehicles require a certain transmission. A lot of times they need to be all wheel drive or four wheel drive. So you wanna make sure you research your vehicle and make sure that it's safe to be flat towed before doing that. I did make a video early on when I was flat towing a Volkswagen Jetta behind my Tiffin Phaeton motorhome and that did not work out so well. I was able to you know, go a couple thousand miles without issues, but then all of a sudden I had the death wobble where the vehicle was swaying violently behind me, basically shaking the whole rear end of the motorhome. Definitely not a situation that I would want anyone else to be in. It's extremely dangerous. So you definitely wanna make sure that your vehicle manufacturers recommends that it is able to be flat towed. Now, if you do need to get your vehicle set up to be flat towed, you're gonna need to purchase a tow bar and get that installed on your tow vehicle. That is something that they do here at the Motor Coach store in Bradenton, Florida. So give their service department a call if you wanna set up an appointment to have a tow bar installed on your vehicle. Number 10 on my list is the Cadillac SRX. This is gonna be a small to mid-size SUV. It's very comfortable, it's very easy to get out out of, pretty low maintenance. And when I was washing motorhomes, I noticed a lot of folks towing Cadillac SRXs behind their coaches. Number nine on the list of the best vehicles to flat tow, in my opinion, is gonna be the Lincoln Navigator. I did see a video that Lincoln did talking about how to flat tow a Navigator, and that's something that's very important too. Different vehicles are gonna have different instruction sets to be able to flat tow them and I really like that Lincoln has that YouTube video explaining that for you but you still want to make sure that your Lincoln Navigator has the right transmission to be flat towed and is the right year but if you want to bring a large luxury SUV that you can haul a lot of people around in behind your motorhome that's definitely a great option number eight on the list is one of the most popular vehicles to be flat towed is the Jeep Grand Cherokee if you go into any RV resort there's a good chance you're gonna see some Jeep Grand Cherokees set up to be flat towed behind Class A motorhomes. I love Jeep Grand Cherokees. I've had a few of them myself. I love the size. Uh, they're really great cars overall, but I think they have had some quality control issues and there's been a few problems that have plagued some of those Jeep Grand Cherokees. I recently saw a YouTube channel having to have their Jeep Grand Cherokee uh, towed like on a tow truck because it wasn't working. And I also do remember one of my detail clients having to have his Jeep Grand Cherokee towed because it wasn't working probably 10 years ago or so. The Jeep Grand Cherokee is a nice option, but do keep in mind um, there have been some known issues recently. Number seven on the list is the Mini Cooper. Like this one here, you can see it's set up to be flat towed. And I know a lot of you saw the movie, The Italian Job, like I did. And I know that made me want to jump in one of these little Mini Coopers and kind of race around. So a great option as a vehicle to flat tow behind your luxury motorhome. Number six on the list is gonna be the Ford F-150 or the Ford Raptor. And towing a Ford Raptor behind a motorhome is a pretty 
expensive tow vehicle. I know these are not cheap, but a very stylish way to have a vehicle that you can still haul stuff in. I've seen a lot of people put motorcycles in the back of these as well. There's a way to ramp a motorcycle up there, and then you can have your motorcycle in the bed of your truck and then flat tow that behind a motorhome. Definitely a very popular option. Number five on the list is gonna be the Chevy Silverado or the GMC Sierra. Another great half ton. I've got that a little more towards the number one spot because I'm a little more of a Chevy Silverado GMC Sierra guy. Uh, shout out to the Ford uh, F-150 guys as well, but I prefer the Silverado. Another great option to flat tow. Another one of the most popular vehicles we see flat towed behind motorhomes is Jeep Wranglers. Jeep Wranglers have been one of the most popular vehicles to be towed behind motorhomes for several years. Very easy to work on. I'm a big fan of the manual transmission. If you can get a manual transmission Jeep Wrangler, again, there's certain transmissions, certain years that you've got to make sure that that Jeep Wrangler is set up to be flat towed, but definitely a great option and one of the most popular options. As we get into the top three, keep in mind, these are vehicles that are being towed behind you know, $2 million Newell coaches, like this beautiful Newell coach behind me. But these are the best of the best, the top three vehicles that I could think of if I had an endless amount of money and I wanted to flat tow something. And number three on the list is gonna be a Mercedes Sprinter van. I flat towed my detail Sprinter van behind my Tiffin Phaeton very early on when I started this channel. Um, now, I did not get the uh, driveline disconnect kit. I would actually go underneath the van and physically disconnect the driveline. It was four big bolts. I'd basically disconnect that driveline and then ratchet strap it all together. Thankfully, I never had any issues, but I know a lot of people do flat tow sprinters behind Class A motor coaches, and that's another great option if you wanted to flat tow a Class B van like a Gretsch Strada or a Gretsch Turismo behind a Class A motorhome, then you could have kind of a smaller vehicle to go on shorter journeys as well. Number two on the list is gonna be the Chevy Tahoe or Chevy Suburban. Also, the GMC Yukon and Yukon XL are pretty much the same vehicle. Having a luxury SUV behind your Class A motor coach makes traveling when you're going out to dinner at your destination a lot more comfortable. So Chevy Tahoe is my number two pick if I could choose any tow vehicle. So ladies and gentlemen, the number one best vehicle to flat tow behind a luxury motorhome, in my opinion, is the Hummer H2. This is a pristine H2 tow vehicle that's kind of stashed out here. And this is how you can tell it's set up to flat tow. It's got the plug right here and then these hooks as well. So the H2 is kind of similar to the Chevy Tahoe, Chevy Suburban, but a very cool, large and in-charge vehicle to flat tow. And I think that's Bradley Twait's favorite vehicle to flat tow. And he's got a lot of experience towing vehicles behind these luxury motor coaches. So if you do need service for your luxury motor coach or need to get your tow vehicle set up with a tow bar, that is something they do here at the Motor Coach Store in Bradenton, Florida. We appreciate all of you that are subscribing to the channel and hope you're all having a great day. Thanks again. Thank you.